different. The disclaimer, I eat my cats, I eat my crab. Okay? okay. Don't don't worry about putting it in the comments below. Okay, I'm you see. already know. <laughs> this is a song. Yes. <laughs> Hi YouTube, welcome back to my channel. Today I will be eating some crabs and having a chit chat with you guys. So let's get into these crabs. We are in the middle of quarantine, as you guys know. Oof. Okay, y'all know. See, this is why y'all can't be over here. How do I feel? about the future and senior year coming up. So because if you don't know, I'm currently a junior in high school and actually I'm very, very scared to grow up. And I feel like it's just so much that I have to do when I get older. Like my mom always talks about how she gotta pay bills and how her car not even working and she still gotta pay a bill. <laughs> it's like, no, I'm playing. I'm, I'm playing. I don't wanna know what she was gonna say. So I'm currently in 11th grade and next year, 2021, I'll be graduating. And I'm actually scared because I'm, it's just a lot as an adult. As an adult that we gotta do and things we gotta take care of. Like when you're an adult, you're independent. Nobody taking care of you and you gotta do what you gotta do. Ew, what is this? But yeah, so I'm actually, I'm nervous at the same time, but excited because I feel like next year I'll have finally, hopefully my prom and graduation and I'll be done with school. I know I know that sounds dumb because I'm going to college, but when I say done with school, I'm talking about like them teachers at, pu <clears throat> at public schools. They ain't it. And if you're a teacher watching this, I'm sorry. Respect to you. But my other teachers at my school ain't it. How do I feel about social media? in this generation. Honestly, I feel like people do anything for clout for one, but that's been happening. Two, it's not that serious. Like people are putting way too much information on their person like with social media. And I don't like that. I don't talk when I eat, so this is weird. But yeah, putting your business out there on social media isn't it. Like. Everything is for social media. And I just feel like they take it. To, ooh, I'm smacking on here. Mm. <laughs> People just. Sometimes you need to take a break from social media because honestly, I've seen people go on social media every day. It literally becomes like a whole lifestyle for them. I'm just like, you can do something else. Like you can go outside, take a walk. I take a walk. I take a walk. Sometimes that fresh air is needed. Oof. That fresh air is needed. So I got another question that says, how do you feel about your significant other creating an OnlyFans? That ain't it. If my significant other wants to make an OnlyFans, then they are no longer my significant other. Huh? What'd you say? No. I actually 
can read lips very well. No, I will not date somebody with the page like that. That's not it. And if you want to do that, go ahead and do that. But I can't be with you when you're doing that. Ah! Ooh, this one got like do. <laughs> what? I rather online shop or shop in a mall. Personally, I like to shop online. I know people probably say in the mall because you actually are at the store trying on things, but I like to um, shop online because online stores, I don't know if y'all noticed, but if you go on, if you shop online and go on a website, you'll see sometimes where an item be like, exclusively online or only online so it's like if i go to the store then i gonna have that and online websites they have things that are in store too so either way i'm gonna get what's in store and online but when it comes to my jeans though i say the mall because that's one thing i don't play about my jeans like i could finesse a shirt easily but them jeans if them jeans don't fit me right there i'm not wearing it Met anyone famous? Yeah, I have. Oh. When you say met, are you talking like concert wise or like down to the nitty gritty and like chit chatting? Like, yeah, Pop Smoke, but he dead. <laughs> you should have been eating crabs in his sweatshirt. <laughs> <laughs> I am eating it in this in the So I know you guys wanted me to do a video on who knows me better between my mom and aunt. I'll do that, but like, I wanna do this. Y'all, No, y'all are saying to do smacking facts, but I don't think my mom and aunt gonna let me smack them for YouTube. And I wouldn't do that for YouTube anyways, even though it's like a soft smack. <laughs> <laughs> Even though people do what they moms and like smack them softly, I still feel like that's kind of weird, but I, have I, well, I mean, why would I shoot a baby? <laughs> yeah, I did a Nerf gun. <laughs> I ever fired a real gun. I shot a real gun out of the gun range. Ooh. And I recommend everybody to go to the gun range because honestly, that was a really good experience and well you for you them, them boys out here who haven't shot a real gun yet with me toting it like you do you need to go there before you do anything because i doubt you even know how to shoot a gun and when you shoot that gun you're gonna fly back break your thumb break your pinky <laughs> Have I ever met a celebrity before? Yes, I have met a celebrity before. Um, I've met Wale a long, long time ago. Like, I think I was in elementary school when I met Wale. I was doing a Thanksgiving, um, what are they called? Thanksgiving, it was, it was around Thanksgiving for some type of like turkey drive. I met him at this um, club. When I say, when I say club, it's like, I was like, being young, doing something I'm supposed to do at a club, I was at the club. That was, that was, that was just a, a spot for the club to be at. But I met Wale. I met, <laughs> I don't even know if she's still, I don't even know if she's still considered a celebrity, but I met Valley Baby. She came to my school. Honestly, I can't even tell you who I met. Like I've been around a lot of uh, celebrities, but I just, don't remember it right now. Do I have a tattoo? I have one, but my mom doesn't know I have it because it's really small, so. It's actually like on my back, kind of. Like, no, I don't have a tattoo, but I wish I did. I
I do not have a tattoo, but I want one so bad. And I got a lot of ideas. But me, I'm not the type of person to go crazy with tattoos because um, I want a job. <laughs> and I know sometimes people, managers, supervisors, whatever, certain tattoos you just cannot have. And I don't feel like putting makeup on my body every day to go to work. Like that's, no, no, nope. Am I a shopaholic? I mean, what is there to do besides shop online? Let's, let's be real. But I do order stuff a lot. Ooh. I'm always ordering something. And yeah. Where I've been. I've been, to, I don't even know where. <laughs> I've been to Aruba, I've been to Jamaica. Um, every every now and then I go to uh, New Mexico. That's that's nothing. When you got money, you can go to New Mexico. <laughs> it's like, no! <"Nah." laughs> <laughs> but yeah, I've been to um, Aruba. I've been to California. I've been places, but I, I promise you, I don't know what it is, but right now I can't think about it. All I can think about is these crabs I got in my hand. But, do I have any pets? I have a dog. It's not technically mine, but I have a dog. It's a family dog. This is a pit bull named Diamond. <clears throat> what is this like you know what, i'm just <coughs> am i an extrovert or intro introvert i'm an introvert in my opinion but i don't go out really i don't really talk to nobody a car do i want for my first car and then what is my dream car for my first car it doesn't have to be expensive honestly but i do want a nice car when i say nice I'm saying like, you know, maybe a cheap BMW, a cheap Mercedes, something like that. But for my future car, I want a G-Wagon. And that car, I want it in multiple colors. Next question. Where do you prefer to study? Huh? <laughs> Where would I like to live if I wasn't in the DMV? Honestly, I would like to live in a few places. Like, I would like to live a house somewhere on the island because I feel like that lifestyle is just different. If I had a beach in my backyard, y'all would have seen me ever again. What's the next question? Girl, you don't answer that question, like, realistically. <laughs> Like, oh, so I would have peace in my backyard. I would like, do you wear makeup every day? With this acne? Uh-uh. Next question. <laughs> Bikinis or one piece? Um, I might have to go with I'm gonna have to go with one piece only because one piece is one piece swimming suits honestly come in different types of designs. Like there can be one pieces out here that, that look like a two piece, but it's really a whole one piece. So I ew. Yo, these crabs are really good. These crabs are from this place called Homeboys. And this is their um crab sauce, crab dipping sauce. I am done eating my food. The crabs were great. If you enjoyed this video, comment, like, and subscribe. And share with your friends. And thank you for watching. I'll see you in my next video. I'm done. Bye.